Mr. Panagiotis Balabanis uh, from the European Commission, DG Research and Innovation. Uh, you are working at uh, the Directorate uh, Climate Action and Resources Efficiency and you are Deputy Head of Unit of the Eco Innovation. So, could I ask you a couple of questions? Yes, of course. The first one, I would like to know what you, do you think about the EMEG initiative and then do you think it could help better framing of the EU Mediterranean cooperation and research? I think this is, although um, this is my first time uh, I'm getting this initiative um, from the press presentations, I believe that this is really an initiative which is very timely and very important because we know that the problems now uh, are interconnected, the problems are complex, and we cannot only um, support individually uh, our water resource uh, and the various resources, we need also to. Uh, to, to look them jointly and I think in this context I think this is very important to address also this jointly and this is important within this context of this conference and event. Very good. What are your expectations for this EMEC initiative and do you have any suggestion to give in order to improve it? I think the expectation will be also uh, first of all to bring together not only the uh, European and also Mediterranean partners but in an equal partnership also to bring um, the people from the uh, South Mediterranean also in the region. And also what is important also to, be, to bring together also the various actors. Not only the scientific research community, but we have also really to, to bring together the economy, we have to bring industry, we have to bring also the end users, the farmers, the people that they are going also to, to find also these uh, the solutions. And I think this is also my suggestion that I would like to, to give is try also to build more on, on, on that and bring also, make these outcomes and debate these outcomes with the, really the users and try also to um, uh, uh, force also the synergies between also the public and private sector.